Teachers can utilize the share screen feature with any type of content to display in their classrooms. Teachers can share video files, audio files, images, websites, etc. through the share screen feature. For demonstration purposes, we are going to use an image that has been saved to the computer to share with the class. It is helpful to have the content displayed on your computer before sharing your screen. Once logged into the Vivi application and connected to your classroom, select Share Screen by clicking the icon. The content that is on the device will display. On Windows and most Mac devices, your screen will start sharing straight away. On other devices, you may need to complete another step such as enable screen mirroring in order to share to the classroom display. Vivi will display a pop-up prompt if another step is needed. When you are screen sharing, a blue floating toolbar will appear on the screen. You can move the toolbar anywhere on the screen by selecting the six dot icon on the left hand side. Let's cover the toolbar features. Stop. Immediately stop sharing. Pause. Allows the content sharing to pause on the display, freeing up your device to complete other tasks at the same time. Annotate. This allows the teacher to capture any content shared to the classroom display and annotate the content in the whiteboard with one click. Timer. Displays a floating countdown timer overlay on the classroom display. Give control. Allows the teacher to select a student to share their screen content. Home. Will take the teacher back to the main Vivi app while still actively sharing. Hide hides the toolbar in the computer taskbar. Clicking the arrow will expand the toolbar for additional feature access. Volume, adjust volume levels of the Vivi display. Movie mode, activating movie mode allows for a two second buffer when playing video content to create improved playback. Privacy mode, activating privacy mode prevents students from taking screenshots. To stop sharing, select Stop from the toolbar. If using the web version of the application, there will be an additional step when sharing screens as a window will appear asking to choose which content should be displayed, entire screen, window, or tab. Select the content and click Share again in the bottom right corner. The screen, window, or tab selected will now project to the connected display. To stop sharing, select Stop from the toolbar.